How's it going, dudes? Welcome back. So, in this fucking library, I think I investigated everything at the end. I did indeed. Oh, I don't think I checked this left side. Nope, nothing there. I don't believe I checked over here. Well, typical, there's nothing over there as well. Lots of portraits in the library. Send something up to the operating room. Like what? What would I send up there? It's not, it's not about any of my shit. And I don't have a, unlike Claire's um, suggestion, I don't have a scalpel. So what the fuck would I send up there? Uh, so we're both supposed to come here or what? Wait a minute, what's going off? Oh. There appears to be a door. So where did I come from? I thought I came from there. Where did, where did I actually come down here? Was it this? Was, did I come up through some elevator thing here? Where, where, I don't quite know where I entered this room from. I missed that. I thought you came from that door. I thought I came from that door, but apparently not. Roger. So that's why I was saying, like, it seems like, you know, where the fuck do you go and stuff, but... Yeah, yeah, I, I did not come through this door. Fair enough, fair enough. Map for the win. Oh, wait, no, I came into this... Yeah, I came into this area and then ran through the door straight away. I'm sorry, I was so fucking triggered. <laughs> you can see a set of stairs leading up, but they've collapsed and can't be used. Oh. And apparently, there would be a door here, except it's fucked. What's that squiggly line mean? I saw that before, a squiggly line. Almost... Is that saying you need somebody to open the door? No. What's this saying? Wall. Nothing, apparently. And that'll be the way back up. Um... Okay? I'll go check over there. Okay. Hmm. Very small area to get fucking lost in. Well, not lost. I just don't know what the fuck you do exactly. So if I stand on that. I don't know. I thought it was like some kind of platform. They were like a pressure plate to get into the church. So I'm almost wondering if... You go do a similar job. Wait, did it do this angle? It didn't do this angle before, did it? I don't remember it doing the angle at all. Oh. Alright, then I guess I'm not getting off to the other side. What's this? Laboratory manager's diary. Today, under Director Marcus's order, I changed the platform entry code. Later, I asked him what the source of the entry code was. He told me it was based on something significant in his own, in his um, children's growth. But the director's a loner. He isn't married and he sure doesn't have any children. What did he mean? Guess we'll need a code at some point. More fuel? There's a computer here. It doesn't turn on when you press the power button. Rude. Must be a Packard bell. <laughs> oh, those old references. Very, very good. Some kind of internal organ appears to be inside. Oh. Oh, okay, that, that's it, just, in, just inside. I, um, nope. Nope. I don't, I don't even want to take it, I just want it on the map. Nope. <laughs> the shelf is full of capsules containing various specimens. What? Oh, oh, fuck me. Oh. Let's fucking just try and molly the motherfucker down. How about a light bud? Wait, wait, wait for it. It didn't explode. Oh, man. <laughs> what happened? There... There, I... Um, I don't think the set has gone up yet. Where I take on... In fact, you didn't see it either, Claire. Where I went into an area. And it's like a piano and... Um, 
you know, Moonlight Sonata in that shit, even though it's not Moonlight Sonata. <laughs> but there was two of those um, ropists. So I cleared them because it was such a bastard to go through the area and get all the shit I needed without going through them. When you kill them normally, they kind of like puff up and then splat with leeches and stuff like that. But do you remember the first time I tried tech on the ropist and I threw a couple of Molotovs at them? And it didn't quite work. In fact, no, I think that set might have gone up by now. I think that might set might have gone up. But either way, the other set that you didn't see, I used so many... I used like six acid rounds and something else to um, get rid of these two. In fact, it might be more than that. I might use a load of regular grenades as well. When all you need is three Molotovs. What did I do when I first tried to use the Molotovs on the ropus? What did I do? I, I threw two. And then was like, well, I had to do a lot of damage with bullets and shotgun and stuff like that, so it didn't seem to really work out. Free. That's all it takes. All I do is throw one more Molotov at the motherfucker. Jeez. <laughs> Speaking of triggering, I, I probably triggered a few people with that. <laughs> Just throw one more, Liam. Just throw one more. Oh, it's, it's not, it's not, it's not thrown one more, man. And then it gets to the point where it's going to be with the acid round stuff. It's like, you're going to use them on buses. <laughs> He said, yeah, and you've got like nine Molotovs and stuff like that. He said, no, he didn't. He didn't use it. He used all his grenades. You fucked it, Lou. Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's all right. It's all right. I'm, assu I I'm assuming that they expected you were going to use grenades on either the bosses or the ropists or something like that at some point. So it's all right. We're cool, I think. It should be all right. Three Molotovs, that, that deals with them. Holy shit. I mean, they've gone from being really scary to like, bring it on, motherfucker. Bring it the fuck on. I'm not scared of them at all now. Free for. I was worried for Rebecca. Very, very worried. Handgun. And nothing else. And then it's like, oh shit, she's carrying the fucking Molotovs. Jammy as fuck. They could have easily been on Billa. Easily. Anyway. These capsules contain human specimens. Each one has a look of suffering on its face. I wonder if it's the folk that saw me only throw two Molotovs. Or if it's the folk that saw me shoot like about fucking nine grenades to kill two ropists and still get injured by the fucking leech explosion. Or they had a conversation in the library. Or the, yeah, or the, or it could be a library conversation as well. Way up. Bottles here as well. The shelf contains a large number of chemicals. The labels are so dirty that you can't tell what's inside. Take them all. I'm, I'm a trying. I, there we go. So I could use the gas. No, I couldn't. Cause, oh, uh, yeah, yeah let, let's, let's combine some Molotovs. I mean, to be fair to the area, you know what? You'd have been alright anyway, wouldn't you? You'd have been able to grab the fuel, grab the mollies, and then you'd have been able to kill him. Because I think you get free. Yeah, you get free bottles. Huh? I know I'm going to pick up in a second light, but that hurts. A hundred bullets on the ground. Damn, there's still fucking, there's like free gas left in it. There we go. You know, j just in case you ever play around with Molotovs, not recommended for a start. And secondly, don't just have it lit and run around like that. <laughs> because, you know, the entire point is it does burn down. Well, no, not so much. It's not a fuse as such, but you know, still. It, it, uh, very unsafe to operate Molotovs like that uh, anywhere. Health and safety inspector Yeah, well there you go. Something some you learn during HSF. You know, don't run around with Molotov co cocktails where they've already been lit. Okay. I will be sure to remember this next time I have a A collection of leech samples. Press the button? Yeah, why not? Yay! One of the capsules is glowing. Take the leech capsule. Uh... Do yeah? This one's shiny, I'm taking it! Wouldn't seem to stand out, it's like fair enough. Wait a minute, you can't use that again, can you? Just in case. Nah. You know what, I meant to say, I meant to say, are you saying what the fuck are you doing here? Wait for it, to, look at that top left there, I keep thinking that's the mouse cursor. It feels like out of the corner of your eye. Where it just appears slowly and shit. The statue's upper body has been smashed to bits. That's an angle. 
There's a button. Press it. You know it. Oh, Bill. <laughs> Bill doesn't have Molotov cocktails, but he's got something much better. Suck it, motherfucker. Oh, you bitch. It still kind of explodes a little bit, but that's nothing comp- Like, watch the sets back when they go up clear, like... One- first time I saw it, it was like a camera angle. Imagine, like, the enemies at the bottom here, like, off camera. It exploded and just filled the fucking corridor. <laughs> it's fucking great. Well, they were both perfectly equipped for that. Apart from Billy's in danger, holy shit. And I didn't leave the ink ribbons in the room. One sec. It's important, leave me alone. I like chaos when it should be order. And I like order when it should be chaos. There. Man, Billy is fucked. He needs an effort. I said, I've been struggling with health items for the last like two or three sets. I. I really don't think I've got any health at all whatsoever. Like, no green herbs. I know there's a red herb, but I ain't got no green or anything. No effort. What's that? Looks like some kind of chemical. You'll need a container to carry it. Put it in your pants. Definitely gonna take that shit. What's this deal? It's locked. What's this deal? Oh. I really want to, um, bring Rebecca down there. Mix those herbs and give it to Billy. More gas? Green herb? Save room? Tram? What was that in the corner? Another bottle? Let's just see, um, bastard. What can I dump here for the moment? Oak shot! There we go. I'll take the bottle. I'm just curious if I can um, put the bottle near to the, um, whatever it was saying. It's locked. You can't open it. Fair enough. Fucking making me nervous is Rebecca with these fucking mollies, man. You know, Catcam just puts something in. It's like, if you were dumb enough to have a Molotov out for like a minute, it, it goes boom. I mean, ideally, if you make a Molotov correctly, it, it shouldn't really burn down that quickly to the, um, the booze, but, you know, still. Don't stop accidents happening. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. Oh. Stamp that shit. Right in the spine, which made his head explode. Fucking hell, that was, that was powerful. That was, that was the right stomp. I don't think I've ever seen anybody stomp on somebody's spine and make their head explode. <laughs> you want some of this as well? It's been replenished with fresh bioorganic fluid. What, the zombie? The surrounding equipment is running. Well. Yes. What's this? It appears to be a device for pumping gas into the room next door. The device is empty right now. It. Oh, well, I could try this here. Do you use that? Don't need to use that right now. Looks like some kind of chemical. Put in the mixing set. Yeah? The green chemical is already in your mixing set. Add the chemical. Yeah. yeah? The red chemical and green chemical have been mixed to form a stripping agent. Nice. Have... Give it to Billy. <laughs> I, don't, I don't even know what I just did. <laughs> Put in the mixing set, like... What? Can I, can I just, like, pump myself out, like... I don't know what- I don't even- like, I've, I've run into one of these before, I don't know what you do with him. Stripping agent's already mixing set, add the chemical. Red chemical and stripping agent have been mixed to form green chemical. I'm sure- oh. I have no fucking idea what that is about. It's full of poisonous gas, so the safety locker has been activated. Makes sense. 
Leech Growth Records, February 3rd, 1978. Well, I guess where this code's coming from, four, double their numbers. So it'd be something like eight, eight, two. Two times two is not two. No. Or, or maybe it's going like four, then double its number eight, and then four, eight, two, one. Four, eight, two, one. Something like that. Sorry, I'll actually read it now. Administer teen to four leeches. Their will to survive leads them first to a... A parasitism. Parasit... Parasitism? Parasitism? Parasitism, maybe. And um, predation. They, uh, then they breed and multiply. Such a single-minded biology makes them attractive candidates for bioweapon research. Afterwards, no major change is observed. February 10th, 1978. Seven days since administration of tea. Rapid growth to double former size, signs of transformation emerging. Spawning successful. They double their numbers in one hour, but their ravenous appetites lead them to cannibalism. Hasted to increase food supply, but lost two. March 7th, 1978. Provided them with live feed, but lost half when the live food fought back. However, the leeches are learning from experience and are beginning to exhibit group attack behaviour. They are also ceasing cannibalism. The evolution is exceeding expectations. April 22nd, 1978. The leeches no longer exhibit individual behaviour, even when not feeding. They move as a collective. They consume everything I offer with remarkable efficiency. 30th of April, 1978. An employee has stumbled onto my experiments. Can a human be a food source? How will the leeches respond? Us. June 3rd, 1978. A day worthy of commemoration. Today they began to mimic me. Surely they recognise their father. Wonderful children. No one will take you away. So what, what does it say with the code there? Like, I, mean, I don't know if it's right, like, but just what I'll go with. It was 4, 8, 2, 1. 4, 8, 2, 1. But I don't know what I'm doing with this fucking mixing set. The shelf is filled with various lab equipment. Everything looks very well used. Shotgun shells, which I do not want to take right now. No. Or do I? Is that zombie getting up? I'm gonna have to quit that handgun, man. That fucking Molotov does not look safe. No, it's not getting up, it's just twitching. It's been replenished with fresh bioorganic fluid. The capsule appears to contain a specimen of leech. The lid won't budge. Maybe it's sealed with some kind of special material. Stripping agent needed. I'm sure it said something about needing a stripping agent. But how the fuck do I get stri said stripping agent? Well, so I was thinking, like, do I have a mixing kit or something like that? Like, a well, person, a suitcase. Yeah. That's how you change fucking costume. Try leather outfit we are. Oh. It's got an achievement for that. <laughs> Fashion plate. <laughs> Rebecca looks a little bit more badass like that. Nah, nah, we'll keep her as she is though. She looks quite cool like that though. What's the other one's like? Western. Man, she kind of looks like, um... Is it Eve in Parasite? Oh, I can't remember her name exactly. In Parasite Eve 2. I think she's got some kind of like western thing going off like that. Completely forgot about the costumes. This isn't solving the problem, but still. <laughs> she does kind of look a little bit like Ashley like that, doesn't she? A little bit. That is fairly horrible. Yeah. <laughs> that came from Survivor's Cancel. Oh, yeah, yeah, cancel. Switch. Pardon? Switch. Switch? Yeah. What? Out of this. Switch. Fuck. I'm very glad you spotted that, Claire. I may not have seen that for some fucking time. 
Props to Claire on that, man. Seriously. Harry Zero fun for Rebecca. It is pretty alright as I did that. You know, if, if I was ever going to do like a second run of Harry Zero, I'd definitely go for a costume. It'd probably be that one Fruit Corset game, but leave her as the original. And yeah, let's try this fucking mix insect. God damn. That could have really fucked me up. Why would that be the first option? Why wouldn't it be like that? And then you'd switch. Fuck me. I mean, maybe you got the costumes first and then you get the mixing set. I'm not sure, but fuck me. Cheers, Claire. Yeah. A shipping agent used to weaken the grip of certain types of material. There we go. Oh, yeah, just carry around this motherfucker. Oh, it's a sculpture. Specifically shaped... Sorry, specially shaped in the form of a leech. Not an actual leech. So wait a minute. Can I go up to this motherfucker? So what? No, no, no. What, what, what? The red and green. You already have the red chemical. Well, I would have, I would have stopped it from being the red chemical now. I thought you could have red and green before, couldn't you? Is it only dispense red? Oh, I had green in it to begin with until I used didn't it? Then it made the green and red, then it made the stripping agent or whatever else, and blah, 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 yeah. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Appears to be advice for pumping gas into the next door. Empty right now. I don't think I'll be able to use this in it, will I? Nah. Can you wear it as a hat? Can you wear the blue leech sculpture as a hat? I suspect no. I expect not. You know, boot to Capcom for all that and shit, but you know, still. Yeah. I, I need to take Rebecca back to um, Billy. If he gets attacked, he's gonna fucking die. What the fuck is this? Oh my god! That handgun is much better now. Nothing here yet. Something- OH MY GOD! No you don't! Ah! I like how he wandered around the corner as soon as I did. That handgun is... baller now. That thing fucking annihilates zombies. The one hit and she's down an orange caution. Curse you Resident Evil camera angles. Shelf is lined with a number of poisonous looking chemicals. All the labels have been ripped off, well... <laughs> <laughs> Smart, I did. Oh, an F8 as well! Very nice, very nice. Oh, here we go, the green one. one. From a stripping agent. Well, I don't really want the stripping agent, do I? I was wanting to make red and green together to make super healy stu stuff, and uh, I don't think that's what. It's not herbs, it should be herbs. From a red chemical. Oh. I don't know how adding green would make a red. Chemical. No, I'm not quite sure there, but. And then adding more green would make um, more red, a more stripping agent. It's like, how does that work? I thought maybe like get your mixing set and you know get some shit out of it and there you go, you got like infinite green fucking herbs or something. As well, as much as in the tank. The sink is old and rusty, it's also covered in filth. Oh. Yeah. Investigators report. Dr. Marcus co-founder with President Spencer. Sorry, Dr. Marcus co-founder with President Spencer of the Umbrella Corporation disappeared 20 years ago. The results of his research have been kept under wraps the entire time. The reason became clear here at the training facility run by Dr. Marcus. Well, not here exactly, but underground. When we ventured below, we understood. There we found the evidence of Dr. Marcus's research into the T-virus prototype called Progenitor. The evidence of years of hideous experimentation that used company employees as guinea pigs. 
We cannot know how many were forced to become subjects, but based on the evidence, no less than 20 individuals were involved. Some of them were taken deliberately to keep the co um, corporation secret safe. Where the Doctor is now, I don't know, but considering the recent rapid growth of Umbrella Corporation, I can't help but think this research is continuing. Yes, his experiment lives and continues to grow in the dark. Those things, the fruit of his research, they fill this facility. The rest of the notebook pages are missing. So that's some investigator roaming around seeing all these fucking zombies and other shit. Leeches and stuff. There's some kind of mysterious thing on the operating table. Is it bits? It, it might be bits. What is bits? Well, I wonder what fits in there. The door is decorated with a bust of Marcus. There's a space in the base for some kind of object. His penis. <laughs> it looks like it. Nothing happens. Maybe you're using the wrong key. <laughs> Fucking blew me out there, didn't it? Um, let's leave that there for the moment. Right. I've got to go down and mix those those with Billy, man. That's all I've got on my head is like, you know, it's red and green right next to Billy. It's like, yeah, I know, I know. It's like, well, you know, you can mix them. It's like, yeah, yeah, you know, you can give it to Billy. Yeah, yeah, I, I can't get that on my head, man. Well, I need to go and mix it with Rebecca. Yeah. Rebecca! Oh, I already tried that. Oh. Much no Malik will have to come all the way fucking back now, but still. Rebecca's the only one that can mix. Come over the right fucking way. This seems right. Oh, I can't send her down. Well, that sucks. Well, I've got to put the F8 in from now on. Rather than um, mixing the green and red together for him, I've just got to send the F8 from up here down to him. It doesn't seem like he's going to be attacked. I think he was. Gonna, if he was going to be attacked, he would have. He would have been by now. That doesn't open, does it? What the fuck? Did I go in here before? Yeah. It's the big ass room, isn't it, with a save and everything else in here. Yes. So yeah, send him down there third. Like I said, I think he'd have been attacked by now if he was gonna, but I'm just fucking worried for him. Well, it's on red fucking caution, man. Like, I mean, they usually radio each other if they get attacked, but... Danger, so, what did I say? Oh, no, 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 yeah, it's on um, red danger. Which is not, uh, there's no other colours of danger, but still. <laughs> And Billy may as well send the herbs up to her. That's probably one way of doing it. What's around here? Oh, there we go. Nothing else there? Nah. Wait a minute, do you have anything to say about that? This operating table has been turned- Oh, sorry, overturned. It looks like it happened recently. How can you tell if a table's turned over recently? <laughs> Send something to the reference room, yes. Down it goes. Big phone sound effects. <laughs> Fairly accurate. Yeah. Right now with Billy. Oh he needs I guess the um the leech key will go in that as well. Fair enough. So what's Billy got on him? Too much. Don't you dare, Billy. Good. Don't, no, that, no, that was on me. I, I don't blame Billy for that, that was me. I, um, mashed the fucking button. Yeah, that's fair enough. Wait a minute, could you get in that door? There's a device for entering a combination, but it's missing a part and can't be used. Well, sucks for Billy. I love 
Alright, it won't be the first time I open a door and someone fucking leaves at me. Fucking monkeys last set, man. Bastards. That must have been a great surprise for Billy. I bet he loved that. I don't close it. Oh, well, this is going to be a ball, eh, could it? Something just groaned behind me. <laughs> and I can't switch to Rebecca without dealing with it. Something's here. It's around the corner. Which means I've got to go back to get Billy's fucking shotgun now. <laughs> Part of the game, part of the game. I don't even mind it, really. It's like I was saying earlier on, like, you know, inventory management is a massive part of Resident Evil, and... RE0 just doubles it. Just amplifies it, and then, you know, some puzzles between the two characters, and, you know, throwing items between them both. Pretty, pretty much trebles it in the end. Alright, motherfucker. Why? I fall for that all the time. Do you know? I've fallen for that so many times, thinking if it's close enough, it's going to kill him in one. And it won't, but I could shoot him at. As soon as he came on, I could have shot him, reload, shot him. And instead of waiting for him to get really close, and you can headshot him in one, but it, it, it's peculiar, or I'm not doing it right. So, the amount of times Billy has been hit when trying to shotgun thing, uh, shotgun dickheads at close range, you think at a point blank range it's going to kill him in one? Too long range or one point blank, but it does not work like that. Anyway, that's Rebecca. All this just to mix a green and red herb, man. I'm on a mission. You were going to send the leech thing as well, Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, good clear. Yeah. Make it seem like we know what we're doing. <laughs> send that red over up to Rebecca and send the leech key down to Billy. Surprises for both Rebecca and Billy. Just tossing inventory items between them. Combine. There we go. You may as well just keep it open. You may as well just keep that door fucking open. And there we go. Blue's gonna open up a bomb. Like, what the fuck have you sent this down for? What the fuck? What, what is this? Some kind of fucking mold of a leech? What the fuck am I gonna do with that? You really want him to wear his hat, don't you? Yeah. Man, that's a shit fucking destiny. This is destiny to wear a fucking leech key as a hat. Could be worse, I guess. The painting depicts a woman embracing a demon. Sounds like some kind of fucking anime. Oh no, no, it'd be fucking demon um, Samar, wouldn't it? Yokai Samar! Definitely be a fucking lord. The lock has been released. Oh, well, don't, you know, don't open the door out for me, that's so cool. <laughs> Fancy fucking door, though. Who wants some? Who wants some? There's somebody who wants some, I heard him. I swear down, I heard some of Is he doing his... Uh, what the fuck was that on the ceiling? Then you see that? Whee! Oh, it's a ceiling fan. What's, what's, what's that? Take the input regulator coil, I'm assuming. 
Um, yeah. I guess that's something for Rebecca, maybe. There's something else here. It's a picture. There's something written on the back of the photograph. To James, to commemorate your graduation, 1939. Hmm. What if that could be the code as well? It's not time for reading, Billa. Judging from the age, that guy could be Marcus's son. Or grandson. How profound! <laughs> Judging from the age, I could be his son or his grandson. A large painting hangs on the wall. The title reads, Woman in Love with a Dead Man. Zombie Summer! <laughs> that was Zombie Summer now, isn't it? <laughs> Holy shit, some weird women around here. Cool, um... So Skelly there? Dust. Oh yeah, there is. It's dusty as fuck, that rug. Let's say about the tank. Mysterious objects are flowing in the water. <laughs> it's an unlit fireplace. It looks like it hasn't been used for a long time. Hey, yep, 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 yep. Light That's actually not a bad, tr you know. Usually you light fireplaces in. No, okay. That, that was not a bad suggestion though, Claire. Generally, um, you do light fireplaces in Ari. How much inventory space have we got? None. So, probably send Rebecca the coil thing and those bullets. Hello. Hello. Oh! Don't- I was gonna do it again, man, just- See? Rather than wait for the motherfucker to get close and then like, oh shit, I better reload, and then he hits me. Just fucking shoot him twice. This jar looks to be an antique. It's full of dust. Everywhere's full of dust around here, apparently. This picture of a... This picture is of... Uh, sorry, start again. This picture is composed of four separate sheets. There doesn't seem to be anything special about it, other than that... Composed of four separate sheets? Yeah, other than that. Despite a few cracks, this pot looks like a viable work of art. Oh. Hey up. Oh, it's another leech key, but I can't carry it. Um. Ah, I suspect I reloaded into the shotgun, yeah. Okay. Can you not combine it with the other leech key? I don't think I've got another leech key, have I? No, I used it on the, to get in here. Remember when, um, at the fancy door? That one's for Rebecca. Remember, like, Rebecca, I tried to put it into a uh, leech key door and it said... Where'd you get it? Where did I get it? This one? Yeah. I just picked it up. I was saying you couldn't take it. Well, I was thinking that I couldn't take it, but you can. Oh! I'm sorry. <laughs> a variety of expensive looking art supplies. For some reason, just looking at them sends a chill up your spine. <laughs> All that money spent on these. Easels? <sighs> Captain Falcon. There was something else in here with like an item that I couldn't pick up though, wasn't there? What was it? I guess nothing. I could have sworn I couldn't pick up an item. Well, no, I just said that. I just said that. You're confusing me now. I'm, I'm confusing you, it's confusing me. I can't take the bullets. Which is a shame. But not really required at the moment, so no sweat. Is it on the map? It's not on the map. Let me just highlight it. As if I can't get around that. There we go. Right. Oh, perfect. No, 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 no. Wait, wait. Can you use it in that? No, no, no. Don't be daft. Why does cat look, keep looking at me every time I say anything? <laughs> like, food? No! Hayley likes food. Four hours! Yeah, she um, has got her timings quite wrong today. Like six hours away! <laughs> so, two things to send to Rebecca.
probably a good job. I didn't pick up the bullets because I want a bit. I don't think Rebecca's got. Oh no, she could have stacked the bullets. Would have been all right. But see, I don't think Rebecca's got the fucking inventory room, but she'll be all right. Should have really taken the leech key first because it's probably going to get slotted in. I mean, what is her inventory like? Ah. Oh, I should have... I should have used the empty bottles with the gas cannon. I could have stacked that shit. It's alright. It's literally like a room away. So, we'll drop the bottles here. Back there. Nope, you don't use it. Not from inventory anyway, use it from there, yeah. Never seems to, like, return. You know, whether you're Rebecca or you're Billy, there's always a... an elevator box. You know, to stand up or down to them. Doesn't seem like it's the same one. Or oh, it's a teleporter, as Claire points out. There we go. So right passing back and forth there. Made longer by, you know, one green herb, one red herb. Yeah, you can have an F herb and shit. There we go. Lock has been released. This leech is no longer useful. Discard. Yes, please. There's been a lot of saves and other shit, like, there's a save room only a couple of rooms away and shit, and Billy's in a save room. Oh! Something is here, but I can't see it. Where is it? She's also locking to it. The fuck is it? Something's- it's auto lock into something. Oh, it's a fucking crawler, man. Nah, 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 nah. Those handgun parts have made that gunner- well, I don't know, actually. I don't think he even used Billy's handgun since the train, so I don't even know if it's any better or not with it. I mean, I'm pretty damn sure it's better with the parts, but... Seems pretty strong now and fires really quick. Oh yeah, yeah, like, you don't want to grab me. Oh, nice feet, dude. These containers look like they're used to store dead bodies. Yeah? <laughs> A strange smell emanates from inside. No doubt! <laughs> Is there what happens at morgues? Oh, that's not- that's not stairs. What's this? Take the sterilizing- sterilizing agent. Wait, don't don't you? Is that gonna take that takes up that fucking huge thing that was like like the size of Rebecca's torso? Takes up the same space as a fucking herbal mix. <laughs> you can literally fold that up and put it in your pocket. But to be fair, I'm also carrying eight fucking full size wine balls. You know, probably about like five packs of ammo and a handgun. But you know, still sterilizing agent. A small tank containing a chemical agent that can be used to sterilize rooms contain. Contaminated by a virus. Aha. That makes sense. After missing the fucking code on that case, I'm I'm examining everything properly now. <gasps> nice. I will take the handgun bullets. You're damn right I'll take the handgun bullets. Both of them. It's a corpse in a body bag. You get the feeling it was just stuffed in there. I had no pride in it. Whoever did that, I had no pride in the work. Just stuff that shit in there. Don't you dare grab me, you fuck. In fact, did it move its head when I went past? It's alive, innit? Look at it move its head. Little cheeky shit. Well, no, I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to start if, if she don't come close, because I, I don't really have much chance, so... You know, just wait for it to walk by and grab a leg. Dick. Was this the same room? With the, um, the gas shit? I'm not sure, I think it was? Yeah. No. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, the bottles! Where are the bottles? I'll clean them up later on. It's on the map, it's fine. 
Like I said, do like the system where you, you can see exactly on the map where your items are. Makes such a fucking difference. That would have... I mean, to be fair, it would have been a nightmare if it didn't tell you where you drop your items. I mean, you could have circumvented it by only dropping it in special key rooms that you remember, but it would have still been a bitch. Um, yeah, yeah, over here. I'm assuming... Slap that shit in. Yeah. <sighs> nice looking key in there. So what, what was the other thing I got? What's this about? N necessary to get the cable car moving again. Oh, well, I'm glad, I'm glad it told me. <laughs> you wouldn't know that, would you? <laughs> you wouldn't know that, and I'm damn sure it wouldn't tell you it itself. I'm used to get the cable car going again, miss. Oh, thank you very much. That's a very polite fucking coil. It, 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 oh, so, something's... Oh, fuck me. That handgun chews the fuck out. It were auto lock into the fucking other one. Dick. Oh, oh! <laughs> no, 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 no. I think she's on danger. Manual reload. Cool business. No, oh, no, she's still on yellow caution. Um, orange caution, even. Take the breeding room key, I I'm assuming. <laughs> There's plenty of room to put two O's in there. Breeding ram key. <laughs> well, then. That's where you breed all the rams. I can think of other ways that could go. Yep. <laughs> it, it could be one of many things that. A key engraved with the visage of a hideous monster. It doesn't look anything like you! <laughs> well, now! <laughs> They're putting that fucking that fire down. Put me on burn notice. <laughs> Very nice. I think I needed a um, a good vape after Claire's burning me house down. Uh, so I guess I'm sending the key to Billy. I'm a, I'm a, well, let's go over here first. Let's go over here. Have I saved this set? I don't think I've saved during this set. I don't think so. Where the fuck am I? Stop talking to me like I'm going to give you food. God damn it. I thought you were talking to me for a second then. No! I said I don't think so. And she's convinced I said the other way. By that I mean... <laughs> but I didn't. <laughs> Where am I going? Oh, okay, right. I'd like the shotgun shells as well, but I can't carry everything. It's the door in here, isn't it? To the left. D to be fair, I think I've only been in here once. Yeah. I'll feel bad when it's time to part away with that very polite coil. I'll feel very bad. What are you looking at? Oh, you're looking at items? Okay. Shit me up like that, Rebecca. Looks too high to jump down. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. It's locked, you can't open it. Well, I doubt this is going to work. Nah. So... Oh, I better not leave me mollies here. No, 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 no. All right. Right, let's send Billy this key. I just got shouted at by so many people to serve. I could feel it. I could fuck it, I can feel it. Even though it's not on YouTube or out yet, I can still feel it. Where was- Oh my god, it's back here. <laughs> Let's say where's the fucking shoot, but it's right here. Handily, Billy is right there as well. Wait a minute. Oh my god, I'm fucking- Through here. 
I could have sent Bill the shotgun shells as well. All in good time. All in good time. What did you send? No! <laughs> and I'll tell you something, that's not just one pack of bullets, man. That's like fucking six or something. Bill's gonna be like, the fuck, man? What are you sending me these for? You've got the handgun. It's like, oh yeah, shotgun Oh, it's not shotgun ammo, it's fucking pistol ammo. Nope. Can I send it back up? Oh. Oh, fuck it. We'll do it this way, guaranteed. Okay. Did it send it? Oh, yeah, yeah, I must have done. Came up with the blue light. Huh? <laughs> well, at least I can do it that way, I guess. I fucked that up. <laughs> slightly. Ever so slightly. But it's like, oh, thank fuck, something I can actually use. Rebecca. <laughs> yeah, he's a breeding rookie. No, you don't do it like that. 98 bullets all rammed into one pack so Rebecca could send it down. And I realise I don't need to switch to Rebecca to pick them up. Not right now anyway, but I'm going to do it anyway, man. Because you know me, I'll fucking forget I'll put them there. You're damn right there's something inside. All my fucking handgun ammo in the world. And this handgun is boss now. I'm actually really happy with that fucking handgun. We do have everything correct, don't we? Yes. Boom, boom. Right. I believe Bill is set up okay. Yeah. Should really send those fucking shotgun shells to him as well, but it'll be alright. Might be? Nah, it'll be fine. Anything particularly dangerous is going to eat grenade. Anything else is going to go down in one or two shotgun shells, so it should be alright. Oh. Oh, so sure that was going to work. Oh. I was so sure that was going to work. I couldn't have been more sure. So what's this room here? That one. That red fucking room. I guess that's where the key will go, maybe. Maybe? Well, fuck me. I'm sorry, dudes. I, th I thought that it'd just slot that in there and then turn it or do some shit. I guess not. Slot that in there and turn it. Yeah, yeah, slot that in there and turn it in some shit and fucking some stuff happens and etc. What? It was, descri it was des descriptive. No, fuck, I did it wrong. Which is weird, because that never usually happens. Rebecca's gonna be like, didn't I just send you this? Yeah, but shit. <laughs> just thought that Billy didn't stick it up his ass, like stanky. For sending me the wrong key. Right. <clears throat> just pull it back out, right. Got on in there. It was gold before, now it's brown. <laughs> yeah, it's looking a little bit darker. It's a bit darker than before. I'm sure it was a bright gold before, now it's more dulled. And smelly. Did I take my shit right? Yeah. <laughs> Saying that, uh, I don't think Billy will take a shit right ever again if he did. <laughs> you know, that, that's a pretty thick handle on that key. I won't fancy that. I don't know which... Uh, do you want to, like, ease into it? By doing the key end first? Or do you just want to fucking baptism of fire and get the worst over with it and go fucking... Thick end first. <laughs> I think, I think, I mean, that's pretty jaggedy, man. I won't fancy either end of that, I gotta be honest. Oh, yeah, that's not the map key. That's the map key. <laughs> I like it. You'd have been able to hear that as well, like tap, 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 tap. It's like, oh, yeah, the, it's, that, it's that key for the map. Not 
Wasn't even pressing anything. Wasn't even pressing anything. What the fuck? I wasn't even pressing buttons. My hands aren't even on the <laughs> pad. Class. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, just investigate. Right, okay. Use the breeding room key. You don't seem to need this key anymore. Definitely throw it away. <laughs> don't suitcase that shit. Oh, different kind of lighting in here. And moths. You see these nice little touches? Look, all the little fucking flies and moths around the light there. I was just trying to, like, see if anybody had put any descriptive text for the light with all the little flies and moths around. That's all I was trying to do. Hey, up. Oh. These look like fucking dog cages. A number of broken cages lie stacked up. They all bear traces of having been smashed open from the inside. This cage is rusted very badly. There's a patch of dried blood on the bottom. Uh, yeah, that's the same one from before. The fucking hunters! Parry? Oh my god, she's fucked. Do I? I don't have... It's gonna have to be Molly's. I don't think she's... If I die, I am fucked. And you never know when, aren't it? it might go into an execution. I could leave the room. But it's so close to the set. I don't wanna... I don't wanna serve. I, I, I wanna clear this and then serve. Ah. Uh, I'm fucked. I, I should learn my lesson, should I? Fuck. I don't, I mean, maybe the handgun can stagger them, I don't, if, thing is, if I'm wrong, I'm fucked. Yeah, if I'm wrong, I'm fucked. That's the problem. You pussy. Oh, I was more thinking fucking you could send his shotgun or something, like, I mean, I could probably send the shotgun up to her and stuff, but, in fact, that's probably a good idea, you know. But I'm still gonna drop a save, just in case. I've got so many fucking ink ribbons and shit, man. Oh, do I, do I actually- Yeah, yeah, yeah. It might actually be the first Rebecca serve. Does it... Not this one, obviously. Cause... I was gonna say... Yeah, yeah, no, not this one, obviously, because no, this is Billy. Oh, no, there's still an ink ribbon there. We don't have to drop that Rebecca save quite yet. Yeah, let's send Rebecca the shotter. There's some shells for her up there as well. I don't know how you'd get a shotgun in here. <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, you know what? I may actually retract my statement of me being a pussy now and dropping that safety save because it's handgun time. Yeah. I'm gonna try pistol first. It's an upgraded pistol. It says it's great at finding the weak points, etc., and shit. So I'm hoping. That's what I didn't want to experiment with. I'm hoping that the pistol will stagger them. But there's no guarantee of that, in which case it's, it's molly time. They're gonna be right here. No. Look. No. See, it didn't stagger them. I mean, I thought it might kill me a little bit faster than that, but still, it didn't stagger. So you know what we do about that? Claire says they look like battle toads. Similar. <laughs> Very similar. Yay. You fall through me, you intangible motherfucker. Where's the music still go? Oh, thank you. I was gonna say. Music is telling me that there's something else here, but... So it wasn't a dog room, it was a hunter... Well, actually, I don't know. These were the two hunter cages, so maybe there were dogs in here as well. Yeah, that... I don't know, that's a small ass cage for a dog. Lame if so. Battle beaches. What's this? 
To the dial. Well, that's what Billy needs, isn't it? It's all he wants. Just the dial for Christmas. Is dial. <laughs> yep. It's important about every item now. I've got to fucking examine it. Don't reveal switches. Looks like an ordinary dial. It's similar to those found on surfs. <laughs> Sometimes you may see a dial on a surf. It looks like a pan lid. It does a bit, doesn't it? Or a boob. It's just, it just looks like a pan lid that's like masquerading as a fucking. as a dial. Probably do quite good in Dark Souls Pyroon with that, yeah. I, um, you notice the switch to the pistol as well. For a start, I had a feeling like it was close to death, so why throw another fresh molly at it? Secondly, three mollies to take down a ropist. So I've got an exact number to kill a ropist if I run into another one. Ah, uh, you see, he's... So you got more bottles in the other That actually, Claire does make a good point. I, I could make another three mollies quite easily, it seems. But still, well, now I can take down two ropists. B-O-W report. Did I say A-O-W? I meant to say O-W. Research to date has shown that when the progenitor virus is administered to living organisms, violent cellular changes cause a breakdown in the system. Furthermore, no satisfactory method has been found to control the organisms for use as, we as weapons. Clearly, greater coordination at the cellular level is essential to enable further growth. I conducted a number of experiments in an effort to find a breakthrough. This is my report. Insector. Or what, the um, the little bug things earlier in the game, like in the centipede room and... Was there some on the train? I'm not sure. Perhaps because these ancient animals have been genetically stable for millennia, when administered with the progenitor virus, they exhibit only explosive, high-energy growth and increased aggressiveness. That kind of makes sense, actually. Well, you know, as far as, like, science fiction shit goes. <laughs> it is extremely difficult to envision using them as B.O.W. Amphibia? Yeah. What, like, um... No way, I was going to say like the Hunters, but they're actually, you know, you say they look like Baltoads, Clay, you just reminded me, I'm sure in Resident Evil 3, there actually is Hunters that look like frogs. <laughs> I'm pretty sure memory might be failing me, but I'm sure there is. Ejecting a frog with the virus resulted in an increased leaping power and um, an abnormal tongue growth. However, no change in mental ability was observed. Furthermore, an abnormal appetite resulted in the test subject randomly attacking all moving objects. Usefulness for B.O.W. Sorry, B.O.W. is limited. Mammalia. The progenitor virus was merged with monkey's cellular DNA. Fucking monkeys. Re uh, resulting in increased fertility. Oh, more of them. <laughs> they already, they just need three. They don't need more, they need three to form like nature's strongest attack formation, the triangle. The resulting young exhibited improved aggressiveness and some increased mental capacity, I told you. I told you, they have strategy, triangle strats. As a side effect, visual... Uh, sorry, oh, so, well, no, no, that was right. As a side effect, visual power was lost, but this was offset by an improvement in hearing ability. Oh. So are you saying if I'd have just walked past them, they wouldn't have attacked? Well, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Like well, so. well I'm, I'm, I'm assuming it's kind of like the dogs, though. If you walk past them, they don't trigger. But, yeah, I, I don't know, I don't know. Maybe. However, they were unsatisfactory as weapons. Oh, shit. It does seem that no progress can be made without making humans the base, base organism. That was quite an in-depth B.O.W. report. All the different types and shit. I like all the insect types that they added and stuff. It's good shit. And the hunters are looking quite boss. Very good. Little teeny tiny tea moths. Mothra! Oh yeah, I guess they'd grow, wouldn't they, to be in size of fucking Mothra. <laughs> I should have done something first. Before I um, go to the save room. Yep. Definitely should have done something first. For next time. Let's set this up right. So I'll send the dial down to Billy and... The shotgun shells as well. Get Billy to load upon those two, and then I'll pick up the bottles that are left here. Ah, wait a minute. Oh no 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 no! no this is right. Yep. See, I told you I had a plan. I had a plan. I didn't trust myself, but no, I've got a plan. Yep. I keep thinking the sign on the shotgun shell box says like out of order. It's like what? Shotgun shells. 
Out of order? I, I swear that looks like an out of order sign, but I don't think it says that. No, you use this first. Like such. You know, I've sent so much shit to Billy and your, to Rebecca and stuff. Can't they just, say, just send something to Billy? Send something to Rebecca? Uh, Apparently not. Breaking the game. Sorry. Has he got room for it all? He's got room for it all. There's something inside. That's a dial. I will take that. Back to Rebecca. <laughs> and, yep. Should I save a Rebecca? No, I'll, I'll break my spree. You know, Rebecca can mix chemicals and you're know, doing some bits and bobs and you're, Billy pushes every shit and Billy saves. That's how it goes. That's his special skill. What are you doing? There you go. There's something inside, yeah. I just sent it. There we go, Billy's all set now. Did I just send that back up? No, good. So yeah, Billy's set with his dial and his guns. And Rebecca should now have inventory space for... A bit of rouge. There we go. So... Actually, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm gonna go sort Rebecca's uh, Molotovs out while I'm here and while I've got inventory space and shit and put her into the safety of the save room. But not save with Rebecca because next time, next set... It'll be Billy that we start with straight away, so I may as well save with Billy. Good. Tradition yeah, I don't, I don't know why I've got some aversion to saving Rebecca. I don't know why it's going to be Billy every time. I mean, it just started off like it was Billy every time, but now it's like a running thing, so I may as well. Oh, there's a green head there as well. I will take the gas tank. Put all my items of shit over here, make it nice and neat. Oh, it used all the gas, fair enough. I thought there was going to be some remainder, uh, remainder fuel, but apparently not. So she's alright, she's got plenty of bullets, she's got the item for this room, she's got Molotovs and shit. Ink ribbons there, there's a fucking green herb. Which I won't take quite yet. I'll get it onto radar. The map even. But I won't take it quite yet. Everybody's, everybody's actually doing alright with life. The hunter room worked out pretty fucking well. It could have been deadly, but it almost was, but it worked out quite well in the end. Yeah, here we go. When I switch to Rebecca randomly, I want a good camera angle. There. And um, I think this is the last ink ribbon that Billy's got. Shit, Billy can't actually pick the ink ribbon up. Wait, wait, wait. Boo. No, 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 I'm not, break I'm not breaking tradition. No. I would rather drop the dial. Oh, I'll pick that up next time. Where did it go? <laughs> oh, it's there. No, 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 that's... That... Which one's which? I think that was the ink ribbon, isn't it? Yeah. Move right... Yeah, oh, there it is, cool. Like ribbon. Again, with your stink ribbons. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it really is a Japanism now. More like stink ribbon. <laughs> Record that, yes, please. Save me from Claire. <laughs> 18 saves, Rebecca's not got a look in yet. That's the last ink ribbon down here, though. <laughs> I've definitely increased Billy's word per minute over the course of um, this playthrough. <laughs> definitely. Good shit, man, good shit. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Cheers for watching, and I'll catch you next time. See you, dudes.